<laughs> We're checking out a home in Green Bay that is like no other. Emily Deem joins us live to explain. Hi, Em, Speed Racer. Oh, yeah. Yep, here comes Speed Racer, Rachel and Pete. Look at me, I'm the blue one. Here oh, I go. Yeah. Craig Nostein, he's the red car. I think I'm kind of getting the hang of it. Craig, what do you think? Um, yeah, I think you're getting it figured out. You're staying on. <laughs> oh, no, no. So that's, that's part of the battle. This is so much fun. You kind of get dizzy, though, when you're looking at it. Um, I, I mean, I can't take my eyes off of it because I want to beat you, Craig, so bad. And there I go, I pass you. Uh -oh. Could you imagine if your home was designed after a slot car racetrack like this one here? Well, oh, Craig, you're off the track. You just uh -oh. got off the track. That's well, Craig Nothstein, who is right next to me, his home actually is designed off of this. I might actually take my Speed Racer helmet uh, off. Is that okay? You can take that off. Got a little bit of helmet here. I have to cheer for myself because I didn't go off the track. Yeah, that's the real, that's a, that's a Speed Racer right. helmet too, isn't it? It is the Speed Racer Not helmet. Five. And if you take a look behind Mike, you can kind of see you have a little Speed Racer collection because I literally feel like <coughs> I'm in a store this morning, Craig, with yeah. all of your slot car racing stuff in here. So tell me a little bit about your Speed Racer collection. Um, I think that actually started with uh, a friend. Kind of, you know, that's how a lot of these things. <laughs> friends add to it. Friends start collections and they bring things over. And it might have been the lunchbox. The mm -hmm. lunchbox. And then, you know, we'd find action figures while well, we'd add to it. And there you go. Well, let's set. Speed Racer race set. And Thanks. let's talk about this track we have right here because your home is actually kind of it modeled is off of at, that. At, after a race track. Um, it's a vintage 1960s Aurora tub, tub track that has a modern CNC routered PVC track built into it. So originally these were six lanes, but we built a four lane track in it. And it was done in Canby, Oregon, shipped it out. You built the track shipped it back, and then we gel-coated it the uh, color of the roof. And, yeah, that roof we're talking about is on the outside of his home. Let's go ahead. We have some video of you, uh, for you of that, um, the outside. So tell me um, how you kind of, how it looks for people on the outside. Well, the ribbon is the idea of a 60s uh, toy race car track with loop-de-loops. And I think it started when the architect was kind of researching the race car thing. He found a, a Fiat had a test track built on top of a building in Italy. So the test track was on the roof, and I think that's what started the whole track, roof, loop-de-loop, -loop, and we'll just run the yellow ribbon through the whole uh, entire project. It really is unbelievable. It's a home like no other. Yeah, it is uh, one of a kind. So tell me, you've been featured um, on different TV a shows. A couple uh, HGTV shows world's most extreme homes and offbeat america <laughs> offbeat america kind of focused more on the slot cars and extreme homes was more about the house yeah and magazines too i mean magazines, even some it's books it's been published uh, architectural record 2003 so it's yeah it's getting a little notoriety and now good but day like wisconsin it's been done now for i don't know eight eight years or so yeah and now what rachel said now good day wisconsin so you're good you don't yeah. really need now to go on any other shows no, or anything now you're we're good. covered yeah now you're covered <laughs> well um there's just so much here to see i'm going to put my speed racer helmet back on because i'm still on the track so i get to still you get to keep going i, I get to keep, crash and burn i'm I get done to keep going you're in um rachel yeah. his wife julie has a closet that's un believable. I have a picture on my Facebook page if you want to see that. We're going to be here all morning, so don't go anywhere. Um, by the way, this place is 8,000 square feet, if you'd like to know that. We're having a fun morning. We'll send hey, it back to you. And when, when we go back to you, could you, we uh, got a shot of the outside and that, that walkway that goes kind of to nowhere, in a way, you yeah. know? Could you tell us about that yeah. next time? Yeah, we'll definitely tell you about that next time. Okay. No problem. Good deal. Thanks.